Hello and welcome to STEM with Mr N, where every week I perform different demonstrations and explain the science behind what we're seeing. This week I'm going to show you how to make an air pressure water fountain. Let's check it out. Air is all around us and air has pressure. If you want to know more about air pressure, I've put a link in the description to a video I did all about air pressure explaining what it is and doing different demonstrations. This week, we're going to use air pressure to make a water fountain. You just need a few simple things. An empty plastic bottle, some scissors, some food colouring, a balloon, a straw, and I've also got some blue tack. First, Take your empty plastic bottle and about three quarters of the way up you want to use your scissors to make a small hole in the bottom, just big enough for your straw to fit inside. The next thing you want to do is put your straw down inside the hole and push it all the way to the bottom of the bottle. At this point, if you feel there are any gaps around your straw for air to get out, this is where you want to use some blue tack and close off the space round about the straw so that no air can get out. Now that part's done, you want to fill your bottle up with water, but do not go higher than the hole that you have made that your straw is through. At this point, you might want to add some food colouring to make your water fountain a bit more interesting. And that's us almost done. Next thing you need is something to catch the water in, so you don't have water going all over your house. And you're going to need your balloon. At this point, you want to take your balloon and blow it up. And now this is the tricky part. You want to try and get the end of your balloon over the top of your bottle without letting air out of the balloon and without knocking over the bottle. It would be handy if you've got somebody at home who can help. And now that my balloon is on top, I can let the air out and we'll watch what happens with our water fountain. So what is happening with our water fountain? Well, as the air is coming out of the balloon, it is pushing down on all of the air that was on top of the water that was in the bottle. This pressure from the air pushing down forces the water down the way. The water then only has one place to go, which is up the straw and out the end. Well, that's all for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like and subscribe and share the video with your friends. Don't forget to check out the other air pressure video I did for more of an explanation about air pressure and for different demonstrations. As always, I would like to take this opportunity to answer any science questions you have about any science topics at all. So feel free to email me at stemwithmrn at outlook.com and I'll get back to you with answers to your questions. And I'll make another questions video when I get enough questions through. This has been Stem with Mr N, making air pressure water fountains.